Skora, which is situated in the countryside of Sweden, was for a time in medieval ages in Sweden, a place of government, of secular uh, action, and also a center of religion and faith. And so I think because primarily of the latter, there arose in this beautiful part of Sweden, this immense Gothic cathedral, Skora Cathedral, which is really uh, a, an unusual building in that it has not been refurbished in other styles as much as many other buildings of great antiquity. It is a great and very profound experience just to be in this building, not to mention to have the great honor of making fine music. The organist Skora Cathedral is really perfect, I think, for the performance of music that has a certain classical point of view. It was built in 1964 by the Danish builder, Paul Gerhard Andersen, and is really attuned to linear writing and contrapuntal techniques. I was considering the age of this building, and it goes back almost a thousand years. Some parts of it, in fact, do exceed that time. It really is one of the oldest sacred spaces in all of Scandinavia. When I was thinking about a program for this wonderful cathedral and wonderful organ, I wanted to pick music that bespoke ages past. So the music that I've offered here on this particular volume of Nordic Journey while composed fairly recently in the 20th and even in our 21st century, and indeed a couple of commissioned pieces for the project, I wanted to give this feeling of uh, great age and tradition. So the pieces that I selected, all by Swedish composers, all within the 20th and 21st century, summoned forth a great influence of Swedish folk music, which of course dates back beyond memory, and also classicism, by that I mean using forms such as toccatas and fugues and inventions, musical forms which take us back in time but are given new meaning and new life within these new harmonies and new ways of expressing old thoughts. Mm -hmm. 